Hi there, this is Mark P. Summers, and this video is going to be an honest review of Famous.ai. Famous.ai is an app I've been working with for ooh, just over a week now. I believe I started last Sunday, and now it's Sunday the 1st of June. So eight days I've been working with this platform, and um, I'm going to show you what I've done with it, what I like about it, what I don't like about it, and uh, hopefully you'll be able to make your own decision based on this video. And in the description below or the comment or wherever you're looking at this video um, is my affiliate link. That link is gonna get you 10% off the Spark version or, or the Spark plan, which is their 100 prompts per month plan. Uh, you can upgrade from there if you want to, but that's a great starting point. It's gonna give you 10% off that plan um, and uh, enable you to get going. Uh, so, what is Famous.ai? Well, it is an AI-powered app builder, and it can build web apps for uh, websites and interactions via uh, a normal browser, and it can also build uh, mobile apps for Android and, um, and iPhones, etc. And so, first of all, we're on the main screen here and we can select whether we want to do a website or a mobile app and what i'm going to do is uh, just give it a quick prompt um to build something quite simple and uh the, the prompt is conversational you can be as detailed as you like in this but uh for this i'm gonna make it actually do a lot of the work just all in one prompt so here i'm going to get it to create a web app that presents uh, the user with a 10 question quiz about how ready they are to use AI to build their own uh, web and mobile apps. Uh, I'm going to ask the AI to create 10 questions with three to four multiple choice answers and at the end suggest that they are ready to start building their app and give them uh, my famous AI affiliate link which uh, is this link here so I'm giving the uh, builder all the information I need and also give them my Facebook group uh, for AI builders and the link is here and that's all I'm going to tell them I could upload a, a logo I could um, well actually let me um, I really love the color heliotrope which is hashtag 8811DD please use this as a main theme color uh, we could also upload uh, screenshots of what we like um, in the uh, 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 other apps that are similar. We can upload uh, a logo, we can upload a video uh, link if we wanted to put a video link uh, in there. But for now, I'm going to just let it do all the work and, and make up its own mind of how this wants to be. Like I say, we're going to create a website link because no one's going to download a mobile app just to answer a quiz. And we're going to go and click go. This is then going to send that prompt to AI. And we're in the process of uh, time to first token. Time to first token is basically when you send a prompt to an AI model, when do you get the first response? So there's that first response that it's now reading uh, the, the pages and, and so forth that it's going to be uh, creating and um, now it's writing the uh, quiz question uh, uh, config and it's going to keep giving us different bits of feedback as we go. Now why this is building, pretty boring to, to watch this, let me tell you a little bit about what I've been uh, doing with the um, Famous.ai app builder. <coughs> I've um, written a book in the last uh, couple of months, which is available on Amazon and um, iBooks and Kindle, um, and it's about um, relationships and um, having your relationship needs equalized, a little bit like a graphic equalizer on a uh, sound mixer or a, a stereo where you have those little sliders, and I use that methodology to uh, help people um, balance their relationship with their uh, relationship partner. And so I wanted an app to help people manage those needs and manage the communication of those needs between uh, the partners. And I've used um, Famous.ai to create that. 
And uh, not only have I created an Apple uh, iPhone app, I've created an Android Google Play app, and I've also created a web app um, that is now available um, online as well. So people can use it via their browser and not just on, them, on their cell phone. And uh, what Famous.ai does is it creates the app, it packages it all up, it allows you to debug uh, the app and then publish it over to uh, Google Play and things like that. So here's my latest version, it's currently in review with both Google and uh, with Apple. Version one is already ready for distribution and is in the App Store with iPhone. And the version four, uh, there was a few um, <laughs> iterations between that, version four is currently waiting for review. And it normally takes about 24 to 48 hours for Apple to review your app once you've uploaded it. And so let's go back to here. Here's our um, apps. All we've done here is we sent one prompt to uh, Famous and it's then created that, um, uh, that uh, mobile quiz app web-based quiz app, a, a lead magnet quiz, uh, and it's used my heliotrope color and uh, used tones of the heliotrope color for the accents and so forth. So, um, okay, how familiar are you with AI tools like ChatGPT, uh, Cloud, uh, uh, Claude, should I say, or similar platforms? Um, I use them daily for various tasks. So what experience with no code? Um, I know what they are, but I haven't used them. Uh, how comfortable are you with writing detailed prompts to get? I struggle with getting uh, somewhat comfortable. What's your understanding uh, on app development? Basic understanding of user interfaces only. Typical, what's your typical pro learning approach? I prefer structured courses. What's your experience with project management and planning? I can manage small to medium sized products. How com comfortable are you? With troubleshooting and debugging issues, somewhat comfortable. What's your goal time? Um, let's say within the next month. How much time can we dedicate? Or at least 10 hours a week. Last question, which describes your motivation? Uh, I want to uh, solve specific problems I've identified. Okay, so I got seven out of 10. I'm almost ready. Um, you have foundation knowledge. And then I can now click on my affiliate link that I asked it to put and also my um, uh, Facebook uh, group, uh, which is there as well. Now, I can go back and I can say, hey, I don't like question six. Could you change it to this? And it will update it. I can uh, tell it to pretty much say, um, you know, be more positive, like almost ready sounds like maybe I'm not quite ready. And so I could make it sound like, you know, um, I'm, I'm ready, or I could make this more positive saying almost ready, but you may uh, benefit from the support of my Facebook group. So it's giving them encouragement on why they, should, uh, why they should do it. Anyway, from here, we can then click publish. We can manage the domain and put this um, on, um, on our own domain, and which I've already done um, with... Um, here, uh, this is a, the iteration I did in a previous video, but I had sound issues, so um, I didn't actually publish it. But here I've linked this to a domain. So within five minutes, I used AI to create the quiz. I used AI to create the app for the quiz, and I hosted it on a domain name all within five minutes. And this quiz was, is then done. I can now go back to my prompts and say, I would now like to, before I give them the result, I would now like to um, request their, user, their, user, their uh, name and their email. And uh, that would um, you know, add that to it. It would create a database. So it was populating. I could ask it to maybe send it to go high level or whatever CRM that we're using. And um, you can add all that. Right now, this is all done with just one prompt. I haven't asked it to do anything clever um, other than just create me the app, and it did that really quickly. Let's go ahead and look at um, some of the other things I've developed. Um, I'm going to show you the iPhone app first of all um, that I was just talking about in the App Store. Here's the Relationship Equalizer iPhone app. 
Uh, you get to sign in. And from here, you get to see the needs um, of both me and this isn't my partner, it's my, my test partner, because um, I'm still kind of developing this. And uh, from there, you can change the slider and you know, maybe you're feeling a little bit less um, touchy or whatever. Uh, you can change the order of your sliders and uh, you can uh, reconnect with your partner. Um, if you want to disconnect with your partner, it gives you a, hey, maybe you should read the book together before you disconnect, like don't rush into this. Um, and then uh, the profile allows you to upload pictures and things like that. Uh, and so this app was created first, and then I created a web-based um, app uh, for it linking to the same database so that the two uh, systems were using the same user base and also the same uh, sliders, uh, etc. Uh, so wherever uh, my client was, they could use uh, you know their phone or their or their laptop to get to the same thing. And this has taken me quite a few hours to tweak it, get it looking right, and get it how I want it. Um, you know, it, I'm not saying that everything is going to be one prompt and wow, it, we've we've done it. It does take one ingredient that you need on top of Famous.ai. Uh, to create apps with an AI builder, and that is patience. And luckily, I've had a few exes in my life that have taught me patience, and um, I appreciate everything they did for me because now I'm um, skilled to be able to create AI apps because I have that patience uh, based on everything that they taught me um, in needing patience. So that is um, the app, and like I say, you can then, once you've created the app, Go ahead and just publish it over to the app store <coughs> and it then uses um, Expo to, um, to publish it over to the stores and then you submit it for review. And um, it's, uh, it's very, very simple. Um, what else did I want to say? So in the, in the description below is my affiliate link. That's going to get you 10% off the Spark uh, plan. And that gives you a hundred prompts. You can upgrade uh, in the, uh, in the different levels if you need more prompts. And if you find yourself maybe you know, for me this month, I've used a, a lot more prompts. I've actually upgraded a couple of times uh, in the last week just because I've done so much. Um, and, and you know that's not going to be for everybody. But if next month I find that, well, do you know what, I'm going to do less now, I can downgrade before the monthly renewal and it will just charge me for the, the 100 prompts um, again, which is um, a really flexible upgrade and downgrade system that they have. And they also have a really good Discord uh, group for you to be able to talk to other users. And uh, like I mentioned earlier, I have the famous... Uh, or not, it's not a famous Facebook group. I have my AI app buildings Facebook group, which you're welcome to join and ask any questions, and I'll help you out wherever I can. But uh, in a nutshell, I think Famous.ai is awesome for anyone that is uh, starting out, and as long as you have that patience and you can write simple, um, simple command, uh, simple prompts, uh, then you will have a great experience with this. Uh, if you have any questions or queries, then please join my Facebook group, comment uh, below in either Facebook or uh, YouTube or wherever you're listening to this video. And uh, I thank you for your time and good luck with uh, whatever idea you have and whatever you're building.